Hello everyone, welcome to QI Solutions. In today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to generate your list of tables and your list of figures. Most of the time, we go through the hassle of typing our project or our work. And after the project is done typing, you go to generate your list of figures or list of tables and it becomes a hassle. So today I'm going to show you. So today I'm going to show you the easiest way to do that. As you can see in my project, I have some figures, I have a table in here that I'm going to generate. When your work is done, if you go up here to reference, under the reference window, go to insert tables you select figures or tables I don't want the hyperlink so I will check it and you click OK it's supposed to generate but what Windows and Microsoft will tell you no table of figures entry found so we are going to fix this let's begin what I have is my work is already done typing and I wanted to generate it and I wasn't able to do so. So this is what I'm going to do. So you go to home and you go to the styles. Under the styles, you are going to create a style form. So you go to create a style. You name it. So what name are we giving it? Let's give it my figures. So my figures. And we will go to modify. Modify the style type you are choosing. Paragraph. So the style type we choose paragraph, and we will base it on caption. So you look through for caption. Caption, caption, caption. Caption is here, and the style for following paragraph will also be caption. So look through for caption again, and the caption is here. Once you, you are done, maybe if you have any other format font that you want it to be in, I want it to be in times new romance. I want the font size to be 12 and I will put in it. And probably let me italize it too. I don't want to choose any color. If you want to choose a color, you choose the color here. I just want it to match it on black. So you just make sure this is check add to the styles gallery so you check that and click ok now you are done so let's add another style this style will oh, we create another style what name are we giving that one my tables so we give that my tables then we modify it that one too will be the style type will be paragraph then we will base it on caption again where is caption 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 is here then the style for the paragraph will follow caption so choose caption then I've already formatted it I chose times new romans that's what I want the font size, I want 12, I'm holding it and I'll italize this one too. Probably let me make this one. Um appears to be um which color am I choosing? Um let me choose green. Green for gold. So I choose green and I make sure add to styles gallery is checked. And okay, now you are good to go. So let's begin from here. So you go through your table. You start all the tables, the ones that you have as tables, the caption or the headings for the tables. So you highlight them and you select my table. You do the same for, so when you get to figures, you highlight figures, then you select my figure. You go to the next table and my tables then you go to the next figure 
I figure. And the next table, where is the next table? The next table is here. It's supposed to be on top. Let me just move it on top of the table. So my table, then we select my figure. Then I have four tables and figures. Okay, the next table is here. My table, and then select this one, highlight it, and my figure. So once you have done, done highlighting or selecting everything, what I'm going to do is I'm going to insert the list of tables. I go to reference, under the reference window, we go to insert table of figures. Insert table of figures. So you make sure you first go to options. Under the options, this is what you are going to select. You select this. You look for what you type in there. What we typed was my figures. So we are looking for my figures. Here is my figures. That will be in the order. I will put the list of figures. That will be first before the list of tables. So my figures, then make sure you check this style. Then click OK. Then after clicking OK. After clicking OK, then you select none here once you select none then you click ok then your table of figures has been generated so let's name it so list of sorry list of figures these are figures Mm. Align it to the center. Okay, we are done for the list of figures. So you do same for list of table. So let's just name it before we start. A list of tables. Holding it, then you align it to the center. Then you are going to generate your list of tables. Go to the reference window under insert tables. You select options under the options, the style under this drop down. This drop down here, look for my tables. That was what we use. So, my tables and make sure this style is checked. So, it's already checked. You click OK, then you come to caption label if anyone had been or anything is selected here you change it to none then you select okay it will ask you do you want to replace the selected table of figures you say no because that one is different from this one so no then your list of tables has been generated easily this is the easiest way you can do it after the whole work is done, other than that, you have to go through the hustle of typing everything again. If you find this video helpful, just like it and subscribe to my channel in order to get more videos from me. Thank you and bye bye.